Hi, we're going to make a new project and it's going to be if you want to put your background screen um, of your app to like a map, an image of a map from Google Maps, that's what we're going to show you to do, how to do. And as um, right now as I'm learning like y'all, I am using these projects I find elsewhere. So <laughs> just so you know. <laughs> so. Um, we're going to call this um, button map, okay? So the first thing we want is a button, and we are just we're going to have that button, okay? And we can change the text here in the property panel, and we're going to put here. Um, map button um, to fill screen. Now let's go to our blocks editor and okay so we go to the blocks editor and we want this to happen when the screen is initialized so we pull that button out and we want to first set the button to um, the button visibility property to true. That's under the logic. Now remember just you can get those buttons either by going over here to built-in or you can just left click and they bring them up. Now if you double click on the left they also bring them up. Um, right click brings up a different set of functions that are available. So, um, then we want to set, uh, go back to my blocks and the button we defined and there's, we want to set the button image to, and now we're going to go back to built-in and we're going to call a function that's called make text and you use this a lot making lists and other things um, I'm going to set that as my background image let's see if I can maybe I want to zoom in a little closer there we go and there's the park the soccer fields and I think I'm going to turn the labels off and I'm going to turn the traffic off, turn the label for the marker off, maybe zoom in one more time. There's a... and there's actually out a little bit. There's actually um, on both sides here, here, and here, <laughs> there's a, a disc frisbee course if you're in the area. So I'm going to get the URL for this. I click on the link and I control uh, C to copy and I'm going to go back to my design page and bring up the blocks and I'm going to get me a text block. I'm going to plug that in there and I'm going to control V that URL right there and we'll see if that sometimes you have issues where it won't zoom in as far as you would like um, I don't know if that that's due to um, Google Maps restraints and businesses have to pay to get a closer view or something like that I'm not sure if that will it'll take us as far in as it's able though and we already have our zoom up there so we we could in fact put our zoom here and to to set your zoom you would do um, and ampersand for and zoom equals and ours is set at 16 you see the z equals 16 up here that's your zoom factor your z your um, altitude, whatever you want to call it. And we want another one for size. So we put that in there. And we're going to 
put this one just at blank. Okay. Now we want to go over here to um, get our blocks and we want this we want to set the screen uh, width and height. So we're going to pull that out here. <coughs> oh, the size is equal the screen width by, that's always an X, right? By, and we go back down and find sc screen height. So that is our, we're making text here. And we had better take off our zoom factor there. Otherwise we might get an error with two zooms. Okay, so we have our, our URL and we have our, our altitude. Our size is going to be our width by our screen height. So it's going to work on whether it's going to be showing on my Nexus tablet or your um, Android phone or whatever. Now let's go back over here. We can make it a road map, but ours isn't a road map, is it? Um, so we put in here and map type equals satellite. Okay, guess what? By setting our button properties to fill the parent, we basically overrode our um, screen and set the uh, image to the screen width and screen height here. So I'm making those automatic and I'm going to repackage and try again. Okay, guess what? That didn't work either. So we might have been trying to do too much with that Google Map. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going over here to Google Maps. And okay, Map equals Satellite should work. Now let's see if this is going to take. Control C for copy. Let's get our Control V. Okay. Now we have our zoom equals 16, so let's just take this out and trash that. And our map type equals satellite. This should work. Package. And we're going to download to the computer. Okay, well folks, it still didn't work. So the only thing I can think is that maybe it's because it's a satellite map. So let's try that. I've tried um, setting the um, background to tra to none, so it's transparent. Um, hmm. Let's um, let's make it um, a map instead, and let's get that link and try that. Let's see if this is going to work this time. Be back in a moment doesn't work. It didn't work. Um, this just goes to show you, if you're looking for code for App Inventor out there, go to the Google Groups, but be aware that the code that's the, they've updated the capabilities to the point where the old code isn't working on the new versions. So um, they're outdating them. 